forget it's a battle. When you have the opportunity to sing, fight. Hey guys, welcome to another week of the voice reviews. Right, the knockout stage is over and we are moving on to selecting the contestants that will proceed to the live show. Remember I told you last week that Tim Files and Tim YJ will be battling on stage for sports at the live show. So for Tim Files, that ball and peace were paired together. So what happens on the battlefield right now is that um, they will pair two contestants together and they will perform and then the coach would select the person he thinks he or she thinks is best to go through to the live show so that's how this particular um section is going to be so that ball and peace were paired together for team fast and they performed already by beyonce and shatawale you know i think like i always say fast has very great contestants they had an outstanding performance the both of them Peace gave us the soprano and that boy came on with his tenor. Faz had to, you know, he had to pick one contestant only because only one can go through to the live shows. Anyways, they both did very great. I think they, you know, they both came together and they blended in. However, that boy made it through and Peace consequently was knocked out again from the, you know, competition. Anyways, Sha, I would actually love to see how they select who goes and who stays because we aren't given much reason or what they put into consideration to select who goes and who stays so it's basically what the coach prefers now on to the next uh, performance noel and elizabeth and elizabeth from team Waje battled for a spot and they both performed Perfect by Ed Sheeran. Now, I think the performance was a very emotional one. The judges were very smitten. The fast was like he wanted them to kiss, kiss, kiss. There was chemistry. Yes, 100%. They even had physical touches. They were touching their faces, their hands. It was absolutely spectacular. I loved it. I felt the emotion. I haven't, I haven't felt that for a while on this show. Anyways, I think Elizabeth sort of suppressed Noel's voice at a point, but they were generally you know, complimenting each other. Commenting on her growth, Roger thinks and consequently sent Elizabeth through his live show, and that meant Noel had to go. Uh, Inu Oluwa versus Ayomiku, still on Team Roger, were paired together and they both performed Joe Boy's Nobody. This song, as the contestants said, I was even quite surprised these guys were giving this song because both contestants mentioned that the song was a bit out of their range, but they were on because this is a battle. Now, what do I have to say about this performance? I think the both guys, both guys were a perfect blend. Ayomikon was giving us the sharp Serenian voice and Inolua complimented with his autoish voice. It was a great performance, great battle. The both of them brought in like their hundred percent thing. They they really wanted this and they were in sync the entire time. So I think they, they were perfect. The contestants are really impressive tonight, I must say. I'm quite impressed, unlike what we've been seeing for a few weeks now and uh I don't know. We are at the point I was just getting less interested, like what what is going on, what is happening. But I think tonight they are really impressive. Anyways, heading to the live shows was Ini Oluwa. Roger said she saw more of a fighter in him. However, I personally think it was Ayomiko. I think he did better, but the judge has the last say. So now, so far so good. On Tim Waje, we have. Tim Waje, we have Elizabeth and Inyolua, and on Tim Files, we have Dapo. On to the next performance was Tim Files again, Tamara versus Naomi. Now, this uh, this blend is good. This pairing is good because they both do the same genre. But the songs they are going to, to perform, the song they are going to perform was like... Uh, Ricardo Banks, ladies and gentlemen. Now, first of all, the pain was like Moby because these two girls, right? I mean, they are good and they perform like the same. And then they're performing Ricardo Banks, ladies and gentlemen. You know, I was like, what is this song choice? It is not your preferred genre at all. However, however, they killed the performance. Oh my God. Like they brought the Owambe from the streets to the stage like you know they turn the song into their own by taking to the high pitch at the end you know the way they do their normal selling dion and all that you get 
they just made the stage theirs they were comfortable i was really surprised but i mean they're singers so they they did the same dance moves they really put their back into it right they rehearsed they had the same dance moves they had coordinate it was just a coordinated performance guys i love loved it the judges loved it they were dancing at a point fast wasn't even looking because he was so into the performance he was just dancing anyways files i i i was hoping he would not have to choose but you know it's a battle so he had to choose tamara did not make it to the live shows guys because naomi mark made it through however it was it was quite a performance and it was sad to see tamara go wait wait, wait. did i just say tamara go no there is a new twist guys this time you get to save one person so out of the four people tamara ayomiku um noel and peace you get to save one person so you are voting the voting lines are open you can vote via the website just go to the website and select your preferred contestant so they get back on their team and back on the game so it's up to you now if your faith if you think that any of those contestants are your faves you can totally save them so guys next week team yemi and team Dari will be performing and they will be battling for a spot at the live shows i'll see you guys next week at this point guys please don't forget to subscribe and like this content if you like it so don't forget to like subscribe guys please do subscribe i will see you next week stay safe bye